Hi, my name is Leah Will. I'm 18 years old and I'm applying to become a Sandra Schmerler Scholar. So I'm just going to start by talking a little bit about my personal life. I was born and raised in Janneville, Ontario. Um, you probably have no idea where that is. So when people ask, I just say a cornfield because that's the best thing I can come up with. And as you can see, there is not really much here. But that's home for me and that's where I'm from. I went to high school in Lindsay, Ontario, which is just about 20 minutes away from here. Um, I went there from grade 9 to 12, where I was part of the women's curling team. I was skip of the team from grade 9 to 12, and we competed at two Gore Provincials. The second one we competed at, we ended up getting third, which is really exciting. And to top it all off, I got all-star skip, which made it even more special. So this past year, I attended Wilfrid Laurier University in Waterloo, Ontario, for my first year of my undergraduate degree in kinesiology and physical education. Some of my long-term career goals include being a chiropractor, maybe an orthopedic surgeon, or something to do with injury rehabilitation, athletic therapy, personal training, or something along those lines. I know that I need to be a hands-on type person, working with people, interacting with people, helping people, something along those lines, so that would be what I'm interested in doing as a long-term career goal. One of the biggest factors for me when choosing a university was looking at the curling programs. Wilfrid Laurier has an excellent curling program, one of the best in Canada, in fact, and I'm very fortunate to be a part of it. Uh, this past year, I was skip of the women's freshman team, and next year, hopefully, I will be part of the women's varsity team competing at OUAs and the CIS National Championships. So some of my biggest curling accomplishments so far would have to be winning the 2013 Bantam Girls Provincial Championships. The same year, me and my skip, Justin Murphy, we won the 2013 Bantam Mixed Provincial Championships. So winning the girls' championships allowed our team to become Team Ontario at the 2014 Optimus International U18 Curling Championships, and we came home with a silver medal, which was very, very exciting for our team, and we definitely surpassed our goal of even meddling at the event. So at the event, we actually made a really fun video with all the other teams from across Canada, and I will put the link below if you wanted to check it out. I don't have enough time in the video right now to include it, but I really recommend that you go look at it and just see what an amazing time we had, and it really demonstrates the fun we had at this event. With the 2016 Junior Nationals being held in Stratford, Ontario, we would love the opportunity to win our Junior Women's Provincial and compete there with Team Ontario on our backs. This would be an amazing opportunity to have the crest on our backs once again, and we would love to win the Nationals and compete at the world stage. As for my long-term curling goals, I would love to be an Olympic gold medalist for Team Canada. This would be a dream come true, and after seeing Jennifer Jones and her team win the gold medal this past Olympics, it has given me more ambition and drive to get there and complete my goals. I definitely take pride in my ability to give back to the curling community. Here in Ontario, we have the OJCT, which is the Ontario Junior Curling Tour. This past season, I was known as the female player's representative, and I will be fulfilling the same role this upcoming season. This gives me the privilege of working with members on the board all across Ontario. I address outstanding issues, answer people's questions, and most importantly, I am focusing on building the youth curling in here in Ontario. This has been an amazing experience for me, and it allows me to keep in touch with people all over the province. One of the greatest opportunities that I've had so far would be mentoring a Bantam girls team. At Trillium Curling Camp when I was about 12 or 13, I had a coach and his name was Sean. We kept in touch and still talk very often. He asked me at the beginning of last season if I would take the time to mentor the Bantam girls team that he was coaching. Of course I said yes and I jumped all over this opportunity. Throughout the season I would meet with the girls and at numerous events and occasions to provide them with knowledge of the game on and off the ice. It was really rewarding to be asked to do this and even more rewarding to know that I had four talented girls who looked up to me. Being a Sanders Schmerler Scholar would definitely mean a lot to me. Being a student that studies in the healthcare industry and the medical field, this is definitely something that I'm very passionate about. There are a few fundraiser ideas that I had in mind. I would love to participate in a crowd sweep. I think this would be a very fun opportunity for me, getting to know all the curlers and all the people involved. I've also worked on a golf course for about eight years now. I think that would be a really cool idea to organize a golf tournament in support of the foundation. A lot of the curlers that I know are also golfers that golf at my local golf course that I work at, so I think this would target a very large audience. I'm also very passionate about health and fitness, so I think that organizing a run or walk in my hometown or even a larger city like Toronto would be a great idea and a great way to raise money for the foundation. In closing, I would just like to give another thank you to everybody in this application process. It would really mean a lot to me to live on Santa Schmuller's legacy, and I think I would do an excellent job working with every single one of you. Thank you very much.